shoes first of all. I don't usually come like this when I come back. I have a bun going on. But today we were released a little bit early. So I thought I'll go to the mall because I had to pick up some essentials. I was pushing it off to the weekend but then I thought, hey, why not, right? If you have the time. I come back home, say hi to the house. It's like you're coming back to something, right? Uh, actually, should I do a little grocery haul? There's not much. Let me, let's go and sit over there in the living room and do a little Okay, so this is the bus pass. Let me take that off. Whew. Okay, so I went to Fair Price. It's actually uh, Black Friday this Friday. I'm doing this on a Thursday, the video. Uh, but I spoke with my Singaporean uh, colleagues. They said, ah, Black Friday is just another reason for them to, another way of them to get you to shop. It's almost the same. And there are Christmas sales going on anyway. So I thought, let me go pick up some essentials. So first off, let's do the Fair Price Fresh Produce. So I've got uh, tomatoes. 100 gram of tomatoes for $1. Not bad at all, right? Uh, to be precise, $1.05. And I have to weigh these and put the sticker on. You can watch my other vlog to know more about that. Then I've got these bananas. Uh, three, six bananas, Del Monte apparently, for $1.88. Not bad. I got some really good deals. And look at the bananas. The fruit here is so fresh and good. And of course, I had to get my favorite, my new favorite fruit. Blueberries. I can eat one pack of this as a snack and be literally so satisfied. These are delicious. So these were on sale as well, uh, marked down by $2. So these were only $2 for two packs. I think that's a great deal. Then, okay, during tea breaks, there is so much variety in sweet here that I really crave the salty things here. But the salty things are either cheese or it's too sweet. So I don't really find anything in between. So I bought myself chips, which it's a big rule for me to not buy snacks and keep in the house. But then I take this to the trading center, so I won't be buying there. So I've got two chips. It's the Fair Price brand itself. These were one dollar thirty-five, the cheapest that I could see there. And these are the potato barbecue chips, so barbecue flavor. And then this is the original chips. Now, when buying chips, you need to be careful to see if it's in fish oil, if it's a prawn chip or anything like that. Sometimes maybe there's no photo outside of a fish or something. So I make sure to look at the ingredients and then purchase so that I'm not eating something that I don't want to eat. It. I actually got some other items also from Watson's. Let me get back to you. I'm back. So the things I got from Watson's are in this bag actually. Oh, I got uh, clothing as well. Okay, so from Watson's I got Eclipse Chewy Mints. So uh, chewing gum is not allowed in Singapore, so they have chewy mints, a lot of them here, but no, nothing great as well, I mean, I don't know, anything like, nothing, I want something good that works and budget friendly as well, which was this, These, there are a lot of pellets in this, actually should I just smell it, because I have elaichi right now, but I'm running out of that as well, I'm kind of bored of elaichi also, like three times a day, you don't want to have elaichi, right, oh, ah, oh, that smells so good, these are green in color, yeah, okay, how do I, Right. Only for one dollar, not bad. One dollar is like 53 rupees. That's pretty good. Then I've got the lip liner that I use for my, uh, like which I'm supposed to use. It's a Silky Girl lip liner in 03 Rose. You can watch my outfit of the day video. I showed my lipstick as well in that. And then I got uh, um, Gillette Satin Care Shave Gel with aloe vera for sensitive skin. This was for four dollars. This was the cheapest that I could find. Otherwise, I was going to buy a men's shaving gel for six dollars. But I found this in the end. And then uh, we are doing our safety training because of which we have to wear like uh, clothing that's like easy to move in and all. So I did not have any pants like that surprisingly. We have to wear them with shoes as you saw I walked in with shoes not heels or anything. So about these pants for $17. I think it was a little expensive for what it is but I don't know. I don't, yeah. So just simple cotton pants that's what we're supposed to wear. I think that's alright. Yeah that's all. Oh I also got these shopping things in my mail yeah i have a mailbox now so yeah everything is in like chinese or something so i don't really know but i'll look at the pictures Oop. so yeah this was this i'll just take off my makeup and my stomach is already growling so i think i'll have a nice warm cup of milk and have something with it so i'll see you guys when i see you toodles hey guys so i'm not sure if we are focused or not but we're gonna go with it i just saw a lizard on the floor there's a lizard on my floor and i am petrified oh 
Okay guys, so this entire video is uh, like a haul it seems. So we're gonna go with it. Let me do another haul. So today I went again as I told you with my friends. So what did I get? From Daiso Japan. I first of all got everything is $2 from Daiso at least. So I got this big uh, jug of water. It can hold 2 liters, 2.1 liters of water, $2. Plastic, not bad because I have to boil the hot water then I was transferring it into bottles. My drinking bottle is this much, so I can't drink a lot of water. Then I got two packs of cleaner. So this is a, it's an alkali electrolyte water living room cleaning sheets. It's good for surfaces. So it's like a surface cleaning sheet. That's a very angry face. And then I've got window cleaning sheets, 20 sheets for this. These are anti fogging So I got these. Then, from other, another beauty store I got wheat from another beauty store I got the wheat wax strip kit guys these are not available in India even I don't know now if they're available but before when I was there for like it's been two three months that we've not been able to find them this then I went to fair price and got three things my friend wanted to go there actually because of her we went so first off I got a pack of onions this was one dollar something it's a big pack of onions right then I've got, this is chapati, again frozen, 10 pieces of frozen chapati. I have the paratha as you know, but my friend had it and she said it's very nice. And then last but not the least from fair price, I got candy canes. I've always wanted to try candy canes. I've seen them in movies, on TV and on YouTube videos, but now finally got these. These are the natural peppermint flavor. I'm so excited to have them. I'm gonna dip them in my milk and eat it. Should I taste one now? Let's taste it. it smells like peppermint. Mm. I kind of like it. It's like a mint, but not really. It's not too sweet. Mm, I love it. I'm gonna dip this in my hot milk, hot peppermint flavor milk. guys it's friday yay it's actually friday i would say it's just the spirit on friday i've never experienced weekdays like like regular people because of flying but uh now in the training we have uh, weekdays and weekends are two days long which is like heavenly so on fridays we're like yes finally we'll get to sleep i'm sorry i just i, I thought my hair looked better that way but then it doesn't because it's like it has product in it from the week anyways I'm still not over how short my hair is. Anyway, I did some shopping today. Oh my god, today after the class, uh, there are two other Indian girls. So we went to the mall, ate, and it was just a great time. We went to eat and all, but then we also popped into Daiso. It was actually closing down and we had some essentials that we wanted to buy. So I thought I'd just do a quick Daiso haul. Yes. So, um, oh, I also got some bread, which is not from Daiso. It's from the MRT station. It smells fresh. You want to see which bread I got? Oh. I got the Sunshine Low Sugar Digestive White Bread. Oh, I wanted, but anyway, this was the best one I could find. It's low sugar. This is the bread, Sunshine. And this was for, this for $2.35, the cheapest bread there available. And then I got these Cutie Special Face Tissue. There's quite a trend of uh, keeping tissue papers here. Like we are hanky people, right? You keep handkerchiefs with you, but here it's more about tissue paper. And also if you go to any, any place where you need to save your table, just leave your tissue paper packet on top and they will understand that this table is taken. I know, so tissue papers are very important. People use it often. Yeah. I'm just, I'm really exhausted right now. It's like 11 p.m. and that's a lot for me because I wake up at like 6, 5, 30. Exhausted. Anyways, I bought this big bag from Daiso, so everything is two dollar. I bought this yellow bag. It was closing down, so I didn't have time to look. But I needed a bag that's big but not too big, so I got this one. But it can hold a lot of things, and at times it happens that we have to go to some other class, but then the classes are not locked, and they say that oh, just take your valuables. So I hold all those things in such situations. I got my friend and I, both of us wanted pens, so we bought two packet and then divided the pens each. So first I've got two ball pens oh no I think both these are black pens shit I wanted blue pen both are black pen oh well and then we got highlighters so I got a purple green and fluorescent orange out of the package she took the pink one 
Oh, nice colors, man. So yeah, but they use so many post-it notes. Every single page has like 10 post-it notes from what it seems. We don't really use that many aids. Yeah, uh, my burn, by the way. It's like it, there was a little pus on this, so it's deflating now. I think the medicine that helped. So for my feet, I use the Germoline antiseptic cream as I've shared. It's amazing. I would highly, highly recommend. It really helps out because it is also a local anesthetic. So it numbs the pain, which is great. And then the doctor gave me four Sudum. So the doctor is at a training center. So I just had to pay $5. I don't know about outside. It's very expensive from what I've heard. So for Sudum, this helped. It's, it's, it's helpful in burns. So this helped to deflate my little pus. So hopefully at the weekend, I'll be able to apply it many times a day. Conditioner, so it's a leave-on cream. Can you see the ends of my hair are like so bouncy, fluffy, shiny, beautiful, healthy. I've never had the ends of my hair be so healthy. But before making Gamban, actually they told us to put this. This makes all the difference because it's basically leave-in conditioner that you're putting on, right? It's not conditioner, I think it's just leave-on cream. It's really bomb, dude. And the hairspray that I've been using currently is the Lucy Doll Designing Air Hairspray. It's super hard. However, I don't see that. So I don't really, I'm not happy with this. I love the packaging. Yeah. Anyways, I'll see you guys tomorrow. So this will be, uh, I hope you have a good weekend. Well, for now.